We've got a special recap this week on the World Crypto Economic Forum. It started off with Nick Sabo. I was fortunate enough to meet him backstage. He was given a great speech. One of the things that stuck out to me was his scaling solutions, atomic swaps, and second layer protocols like Lightning and Mimblewimble. Really a blockchain expert, Nick. Next, I talked to the Metal team about their delisting from Bittrex. They gave me the same response as their official answer. Once the app's ready, they're getting relisted on Bittrex. I'm liking my buys here on this bad delisting news. Even if things go south, it's still listed on Cryptopia. Then I talked to the president of NEM. NEM. He told me they were based out of Singapore and pretty popular in Japan, while being fairly unknown in the USA. We got into it deeper about development, and he told me about their API version 2.0 that's going to be coming out pretty soon. They've increased performance by 10 times. He's told me stories about developers developing on this platform a new dApp in only one night. There was lots of ICO projects at this conference. Here's one that stood out to me. The Codex Protocol. These guys are doing centralized arts and collectibles right now, but they're looking to make it more decentralized. Putting the ownership titles of these things on the blockchain. The highlight of the show, Ashton Addison, the CEO of Event Chain, giving a presentation on YouTube influencers. He stunned the crowd, letting them know that YouTube might be taking over Google as the number one search engine this year. He's using lots of excitement and real world examples. What a great talk. You guys want to check that one out if you can find it online. If you need more info about this conference, it was a great event. Their website's wcef.co. Make sure you click the subscribe button for the CryptoCoin YouTube show. And if you aren't following me yet, get over to Twitter and follow me at Jesse Couch.